thank you so much for watching the replay. Thanks for clicking on this video. I'm Allison with Upright and Caffeinated and it's time to rise and shine because it's crafting time. We are gonna do a fun project this morning, a back to school sign. So I'm really excited to share this with you guys this morning um, as kids are getting ready to go back to school, whether that's at home or actually in a classroom. Either way, you need a sign for your kid because this is gonna be a memorable year. So if you are joining live, make sure you pop in and say good morning so I can say hi and I can tell you good morning. So um, let's see here. I'm gonna pull out this transfer and we are gonna get everything ready. Good morning, mom, good morning. Thank you guys for sprinkling the love. And if somebody could do me a huge favor this morning and um, it, it share this over to my coffee chalk group. If anybody who's in my coffee chalk group can hit the share button and share it over to Coffee Chalk. That would be really great and I would really appreciate it. Um, the way I'm doing this now, I used to be able to go live and it would like automatically, like I could pick going live here and in Coffee Chalk all at the same time. But now that I'm doing it just from my phone, just from this angle and I don't have the two angles anymore, it doesn't let me choose to share it to two places. So, good morning, Anna. Good morning, you guys. All right, well let's jump in and get started. So, first of all, I wanna tell you guys, I am using a board from Walmart, and I like this board because it has this little frame, but I want you guys to see something. See how you can see this was uh, from 2019, 2018? See how you can see the shadow of that where I had the old transfer? This is what happens when you use cheap surfaces. <laughs> so I just wanted to point that out. Um, in case you're thinking, oh, I don't want to spend, you know, $8 or $9 on a surface. I'll go get a $2 surface or a $3 or $5 surface at Walmart. This is what happens. You can still see what I had on there um, from the 2018-2019 school year. So, thank you, Mom. Thank you. Um, so, first, I wanted to point that out. We're still going to use this. Um, because I do like that it has the little um, wooden frame. It looks very school-esque. <laughs> and so we're gonna use it, but I did wanna point that out to you guys. All right, so we are actually, I'm gonna attempt to do two signs, um, one for each kid on either side, which means we're gonna use some of these things twice. And so we're gonna use it, lift it up, and then use it again. Now, I do wanna mention that I linked, sorry, I'm looking for my fuzzing cloth. Where'd it go? I'm missing a fuzzing cloth. Oh, there it is. Um, I did link to the school days transfer. It is slightly different than the transfer I'm using. I'm using the old school days transfer. They have upgraded it. It's a much better transfer. <laughs> um, so that's the one I linked to um, up in the description. Uh, this one only had the first day of, it doesn't have last day of school. The new transfer, the upgraded one has first day and last day. Um, and then there's, there's only some slight differences. It's got, um, all the same words, all the same numbers. Uh, it, it has, um, it has more words. It actually has freshman, sophomore, junior, and senior. It has some hashtags, school days and teacher life. Um, and it has a little globe that is super cute. Um, so it just has some other little elements that are more than what the old school days transfer had. Um, but I am using the old one this morning because that's the one I have. Okay, so we are gonna do first day of, we're gonna use it on this side and then I'm gonna flip this over and we're gonna use it right on the back. Good morning, Cece. Good morning, Tammy. Good morning. I'm so glad you guys are joining this morning. So the question for the day is, what are your kids or your grandkids doing for school this year? Are they going in person? Are they um, doing virtual? We are actually, um, our school district has gone 100% virtual for the entire first semester. So the remainder of 2020, the remainder of 2020 calendar year will all be virtual. And I actually just got off the phone with the boys principal just because I had a couple questions and they still don't know a lot of stuff. Um, he, you know, they're still waiting on the board of ed to, to give them some direction and things like that. But they did assure us that it will look 
different uh, than it did in the spring, which is great because the spring was kind of tough. So, good morning, good morning. Oh, good morning, Patty. Wow, from Washington State, it is early there. Thank you for getting up so early and joining me this morning. Okay, so we just did first day of, and I used it on one side, peeled it up, used it on the other side. Really easy, really quick. All right, and we are using just plain white chalk paste this morning. I didn't wanna start mixing in different colors, but if you're doing this for, um, especially for older kids, like your, your high school kids, Definitely, I would suggest doing school colors because that's super fun. Um, you know, I'm, I'm doing my little, my little kids, and so I don't, oh, and I need scissors. I just realized I haven't cut out second <laughs> because I have a, a little one that's going into second grade, and I did not cut out the second. So let me grab my scissors real quick. So yeah, since I'm doing my little ones, I am not doing um, school colors. We're doing it just in white. And I think, you know, white chalk paste on a black chalkboard is so classic and it looks great. Good morning, Swati. Good morning. Okay, so we have first grade, or no, first day of, and then I have kindergarten, I have second grade, because I've got a kindergartner and a second grader. And then we have a bunch of different little elements. There's numbers, and you could actually use these numbers instead of the, the numbers that say second. Um, of course, I think on the new one, it's just numbers. It's, they don't give you the, like this, that has the ND or the RD on it. Um, let me see, what other little elements come with this one? I've got one that says pre-K or preschool. I've got a little pencil, so all kinds of things. So we're gonna do first day of, and let's do Blakey's first. So we'll do first day of kindergarten, and then we'll do Brooks's on the other side that says first grade. So I can add the year at the bottom of this so that we can remember, we can remember this year. I don't think we're gonna forget this year. <laughs> Good morning, Debbie. Good morning, you guys. All right, I'm actually gonna hit this with a hair dryer because that is still really wet. Let me hit this with a hair dryer really quickly, and then we're gonna chalk kindergarten on one side and second grade on the other. Good morning, you guys. I'm so glad you're joining me this morning. All right, so I've got kindergarten for Blakey. We're just gonna chalk that right in. So simple and so quick and so easy. You don't have to do calligraphy and it looks like you did something fancy. You know, it's so easy to do this and it looks so good. Okay, so there's kindergarten. Look how cute that is. And then we'll do second grade on the other side. And I am fuzzing this transfer. I've got my fuzzing cloth right here on my lap and we're gonna fuzz, fuzz, fuzz this transfer. I'm gonna fuzz this really well for a couple of reasons. One, I've never used the, I've never used the second. So it's a new transfer. And I wanna make sure I get a good layer of fuzz on it because those new transfers are super, super, super sticky. The other reason is because this isn't a chalk couture surface, it's a, um, it's a Walmart surface. And honestly, I don't think it's a real chalkboard. I think they just like painted a piece of wood black. Um, and you can kind of tell that by the way that the, the paste where I had it before, and I showed this earlier, so if you missed first thing this morning, see how you can see the shadow of what I had on there before? This was from Brooks's kindergarten year in 2018. You can see that shadow, and that's because it's a Walmart board, and it's cheap, and I don't think it's real chalk. It's not like a real chalkboard surface. It's just a black painted surface. So, 
you have grandkids that are going in person and grandkids that are virtual learning at home. And I think that's kind of typical. I think people are going to kind of be split and, you know, I, I've heard some schools are doing certain ages are doing, um, you know, virtual and certain ages are doing in person. I think the virtual definitely would work better for older kids, little kids. I, I do not know how we're going to teach, um, how kindergarten is going to be virtual. <laughs> that just, kinder, virtual kindergarten, it just doesn't really make sense. Uh, let's see. Yeah, and then your granddaughter is going to be virtual too, Patty. Yeah. The, I think that's kind of the norm. That is going to be the norm. All right, so I am fuzzing, fuzzing, fuzzing. And we're gonna do second grade right here. But either way, whether your kids or grandkids are in person or virtual, they need a they need a first day of school sign. And so, if you are in my coffee chat group, I posted a really funny picture last night that I saw and it was a little kid like in full hazmat <laughs> holding a first day of school sign. It was really, really funny. I mean, sad and funny all together. We're just going with the flow at this point. <laughs> so I'm gonna do this little pencil right here and y'all, I have chalked that pencil on every first day of school sign I have ever made. So I am not gonna fuzz that because I've actually used this pencil quite a few times. So again, we're doing both sides of the sign. I'm flipping it over. I'm gonna put it down. I'm gonna chalk it in. And as long as you're using the same transfer with the same color, um, it, if you work quickly, you can use it, pick it up, and put it back down. So first day of kindergarten, first day of second grade. Good morning, Michelle. Good morning, both Michelles. <laughs> You both, you, both your comments just showed up at the exact same time. Good morning. Hmm. Okay. So I think I want to add the little apple. There's a little apple that comes with this one. So I'm going to add a little apple. I'm going to put a little apple right over here. And again, I'm just using white. You could use any colors, match school colors, do your kids favorite colors, do whatever colors you happen to have. But I think the white on the plain chalkboard just looks so classic, especially for our first day of school sign. Um, and especially this particular sign that has this little wood trim, which to me looks like a typical school chalkboard. So let's see. Okay, so I have first day of second grade and then first day of kindergarten. We're gonna add a little top to that apple. Super easy. Actually, let me grab my dryer and let's dry that apple off before I start doing that. Then we're gonna add the year at the bottom and maybe we'll add the little flags at the top. Let's see. But this is really fun because you can add kind of just whatever elements you feel like adding. And if there are elements on another, um, with another transfer, you can add that too. Um, like if you go to school out in the country, you could add uh, the little hay bales from the fall add-on from the vintage truck fall add-on all kinds of ideas that you could do with it so this one came with these little flags and I think they're absolutely adorable and we can add them to the top there we can just throw these right up here at the top and then do the same on the other side and it doesn't really matter what order you do 
these transfers, you know, as long as it fits, you can do it however you want. There's no particular order that, you know, it's not numbered. It doesn't say do this first, then this first. You can do it however you'd like. Cute, cute, cute. Let's flip this over and we're doing it right on the other side. All right. I'm just going to lay that down. Perfect. And we'll just chalk this one in. I like these little flags. They're super cute. Huh. I just want to make sure I get them all chalked in. There we go. Looks great. Adorable. So I'm done with that. So this is really fun because I get to do two signs basically at the same time. All right. So we've got first day of second grade, first day of kindergarten, and then we can just add the year if I can find the two and the zero because that's all we need is 2020. Um, I did have a little owl over here in this other corner. Um, the owl's not in the new, it's not on the, the new one. It, that one has the globe and I like the globe so much better. It also has like a little stack of books that's super cute. The, the owl is cute for like preschool or maybe kindergarten, but um, for like second grade and stuff, like the books are cute and the, I again, love the globe. So I think we're gonna skip putting the owl on, but let's go ahead and let's do, we're gonna chalk in this two a whole bunch of times because we're gonna do 2020, all right? So we're gonna chalk two here, and I'm gonna move it over. We're gonna chalk two here. And y'all, if you want this to be straight, you can use some placement tape or a painter's tape, you know, to kind of make a straight line. Um, if you have watched me at all, even for a second, you may or may not know, but you probably do know, I don't measure anything. So I eyeball everything all the time. Um, so I'm just eyeballing it and we're just gonna do 2020 and it's gonna look fantastic. I am not a measure kind of person. I am not very, um, I'm not real exact and I'm not very critical. <laughs> so that's just how I am. Uh, so we've got, so far, we've got our twos. So let's go in with the zeros. Let me dry the, let me dry my twos off and then we're gonna, we're gonna do our, our zeros and then we're gonna be done with these signs. And we've done two signs in a matter of, I don't know, maybe 20 minutes, maybe. I love this because it is quick to do. It is very, very easy and quick. There we go. And if you wanted to put like, you know, the word virtual, like first day of virtual second grade or something like that, you could totally do that with any of the fonts. Like I could use the handwritten font or one of the other fonts and write the word virtual on this if I wanted to. I don't think we're gonna forget 2020 was virtual. I think we're all gonna remember that. <laughs> Good morning, Alisa. Good morning. Yes, Patty, I do. It's called Coffee Chalk. And I will... I will link it in the description as soon as I'm done. So if you'd like to join, it is called Coffee Chalk. All right. Good morning, Gail. Good morning, you guys. Oh, I'm so glad so many of you are joining me this morning. Let me just wipe my fingers off with a little baby wipe real quick because somehow I have managed to get white paste all over myself. Okay. 
So I think this looks absolutely adorable. I'm gonna put my jar back together. I'm gonna scrape all that excess paste right back in my jar. And we're gonna be good to go. Two signs, 20 minutes. Two kids have their first day of school signs, you guys. This is awesome. This took like no time at all. And again, I'm just gonna wipe this off and use it again for next year. Okay, so there's Blake's side, first day of kindergarten, 2020. Look how cute. And then there's Brooks's side, first day of second grade, 2020. Look how cute those are. I love them. What do you think, you guys? Is it cute? Is it cute? I like that you can make it as complicated or as simple as possible, or as simple as you want. I mean, I could have left the little flags and the little um, apple off and just had the words first day of with the with the year. Um, but I like the little the little pennant banner thing on the top. There, it's cute. And again, like I mentioned, the upgraded version of this transfer is available. Um, I am using the old, 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 outdated, retired version of this transfer. The upgraded version is much, much better, much cuter. I just, since I have the old version, I figured I would show you guys. Yeah, Gail, I think the flags are super cute too. Thank you. <laughs> My husband's motioning. <laughs> Look how cute. So yeah, so now my kids are ready for virtual school. Yeah, I hope everyone has a great year too. I'm, um, I'm hoping all goes well. I've been assured that virtual learning will look very different uh, in a couple of weeks than it did in the spring, which I hope so, because it didn't go so well in the spring. But um, I, I, I am uh, fully confident that um, the teachers and the administrators have, have took all the parents' concerns into uh, account and everyone's gonna make it a great year so you like that I do too Natasha I think it looks like a typical you know school chalkboard I like it in just white let the fun begin at school yes yes Jackie I'm so glad you like them too yeah, we'll, we'll be ready for the school year. And like I said, whatever it happens to look like, um, you know, kindergarten on a Chromebook, we'll figure out how to do it. Um, I'm sure there's gonna be just a lot of things um, that we do at home and, um, you know, we'll, we'll see. <laughs> My kids, for, for art class, they will do chalk couture. We'll, we'll, we'll let that count as art. So um, if anybody has any questions, please leave them in the comments below and I am happy to answer them. I will see you guys back here tomorrow morning at 8.30 a.m. Eastern. I am so glad you guys joined me this morning. Hope everybody has a wonderful Thursday and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Thanks.